Today we're going to talk about strength. Rugby is a sport where you obviously need a lot of strength. Each position is slightly different. For my position, we like to focus a lot on the scrum. It requires a lot of core strength, lower back, obviously leg strength, and then your neck takes a lot of pounding. Just heading to the gym right now. I'll show you a couple exercises that we like to do to get the game ready. One of the things we like to do is uh, just some quarter squat isometric holds. Uh, the reason only a quarter squat is it kind of mimics the perfect scrumming position and also it's a lot easier on your knee joints than if going full. First thing you want to just address the bar. Make sure you uh, keep your lats good and tight, tighten up the core, and then just sink down, making sure not to flare out your knees, keeping the core tight, keeping the lats nice and tight, making sure everything's good. Hold for about four or five seconds, and then just extend out, take a deep breath, core out again, and then repeat that five or six times. So this exercise is the uh, diagonal or D lunge. Essentially same thing as the squat, just keep everything tight, take a 45 degree step, and then really explode back out, and then alternate. This definitely helps us strengthen lateral movement because it's pretty rare in rugby where you're just running straight or tackling straight. There's often times you'll have to go off to one side or the other. This uh, allows for a little bit of sideways movement. Typically we would do four to six a leg, and then that would be one set. This next exercise is back extensions. Really strengthen the lower back aspect of the core and the glutes. Particularly important in the scrumging aspect of the game. Allows you to transfer forces through you onto the opposition and through the opposition onto your players so that you don't crumble, basically. Stay as straight as possible and then just dip down and then back up. If you want to make it more difficult, put your hands over your head. Go for 12 to 15 reps and then repeat that for three or four sets. Start with body weight to warm everything up and then pick up a kettlebell. The stronger and fitter you are, the easier it is when it comes to the game time. So put the work in the gym.